Sí. Será. Wanna say hi to the camera? Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Jazz. Thank you for tuning in. And today I'm gonna share with you my DIY. It's not really DIY. I just put it together. But I'm doing a Jenga sign-in, kind of like wedding guest book. The reason I decided to do a Jenga sign-in is because I'm not really traditional when it comes to like a wedding book and I feel like if I had a book I would just open it and then read it like oh best wishes congrats and then I would read it once and then it would just go in my closet somewhere and hide forever so I wanted something that we could you know see over and over or people would like enjoy so I decided to do the Jenga sign-in. It's gonna go in this gold and glass, beautiful box. And when everything's all signed and we have guests come over and we play Jenga, people can read whatever kind of joke or random goofy things on there. Our best wishes, advice, whatever people wanna write on there. And I think everyone will get a kick out of it and it looks super cute. It's actually one week before our wedding so I'm not wearing any makeup, just wearing eyebrows that I filled in because I want my skin to clear up, okay? Let's get into it. All right, so the lantern on the right-hand side, that's where wedding guests can put their cards in there. A picture of us in Cancun in a gold frame. We already had it. It was been sitting in our room, so that was a win. Jenga game, of course, thin black markers, hand sanitizer on deck, and then the golden glass trinket box. The instructions for the sign-in are on this board. It lights up with batteries, super cute, and it's just standing on an easel. It says, wedding guest sign-in instructions. Choose a Jenga piece, write a message, your best wishes for us, a joke, a memory with us, a prayer, or something random, and sign your name and then reminds them to use hand sanitizer and then they can place that in the box. We are just super excited to read all the signed Jenga pieces after the wedding. It's gonna be really fun to play it after. So creating the instructions, I used cardstock paper, which is really thick paper, and then I used my paper slicer, and all that was from Amazon. So anything from our wedding that's from Amazon will be in my Amazon storefront, and you can shop that there. Just personalized the board, added a little Polaroid picture of us on there, and our hashtag, so for all the tech savvy people that like to put hashtags and we can find all our wedding pictures in that hashtag. Super excited, less than one week away, getting all the butterflies and I'm actually excited to share all my wedding finds with you guys. Wanna go? Wanna go on a walk? Make sure you bubble wrap all your glass items so it makes it to its destination nice and safely. This should do it. decided to switch sides. You don't like that side, huh? Okay. This is your good side. Hmm? You like your good side? So I will link everything from Amazon that I used to create the things that I have. Um, I have my paper cutter or paper slicer and then I also use cardstock paper which is a really thick paper they have them in different colors so you can shop all that stuff even the Jenga I think that in Amazon thank you guys so much for watching I hope you really enjoyed this video if you did go ahead and give me a thumbs up don't forget to like subscribe hit the bell share this with a bride-to-be and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day